A quick little trip with him turns into about a three hour adventure. When Philip Blanchard drives down the street, people stare. He thinks he's more of a dog than a duck. That's because his passenger can barely see out the window, but insists on sitting in the front seat. Don't you think, buddy, you want to go on a visit? Webster the therapy duck visits about three different places a week. Tuesday is his first visit to Vita Health Services, a residential facility in Des Moines for people with mental illnesses. Come on, Webster. Not shy at all, Webster makes his presence known right away. Hey, Webster, hey. Quickly nestling into place on anyone's lap. His favorite spot is right there on his chest. He's so soft and you, you just want to hug him. Yes, he does have a diaper. He may not be a dog or a cat, but this domestic mallard brings comfort to anyone he touches. He's a nice bird. Webster started out as a family pet. Yeah, I've got some treats. But Blanchard recently enrolled him in the ARL therapy pet program. What you looking at? After realizing his duck acts more like a person than an animal. He's always been so personable. So personable, he even wanted his picture with Santa. Loves the to be social and out and about. There he goes. Webster even has his own Facebook page detailing his adventures, visits to nursing homes and kids camps. Just the joy on their face to be able to pet something that's different than a cat or a dog and feel how soft his feathers are. It's been amazing. He's super popular because uh, it's a novel thing. People don't see a duck going out and sitting on people's laps and wanting to get attention. So popular, Webster's schedule is pretty jam packed. He's five years old. Actually, today is his birthday. But he always has time to cuddle and comfort anyone around him. Webster, here we go.